Police are looking for the person who shot a cat in the head with an arrow. 4029's Yugochi Iloka is live where the cat had emergency surgery in Fayetteville, and she tells us what investigators are doing to find the person who did it. Yes, Simba did survive, and he's recovering right now here at the Fayetteville Animal Shelter. Now, this morning, he was found with an arrow all the way through its head. We do have pictures of him when he was found, and I've got to tell you and warn you that it may be upsetting for you. At first, I was upset, and then I became angry. This is a woman who found Simba curled up in a ball, purring in pain. I heard this meow behind me, and I looked behind this red couch that was on the porch, and one of the cats was in the porch boards with an arrow through his head. She lives right across the street and was cat sitting for her neighbors who were out of town. When she went over to feed them, that's when she saw Simba and called animal control. Very emotional. I couldn't even talk to the animal control officer. Fayetteville Animal Control made their way to Happy Hollow Street where they found Simba. They took him to the clinic and the vet performed surgery. They were able to remove the arrow successfully without injuring Simba any further. It, it is worse than it looks. I mean, it's a very lucky cat. Um, um, a fraction of an inch one way or the other, and it would have been the end of the cat. And the vet is keeping a close eye on Simba here at the shelter. Police are searching the neighborhood and talking to people who live there, and they say if they find the person who did this, that person will be charged with a felony. Reporting live in Fayetteville, Ugochi Aloka, 4029 News. Thanks, Ugochi, and we're glad Simba's okay. His owners right now are, are in Florida. They'll be back on Friday. And we've just learned that the Animal League of Washington County is offering a $500 reward for information that helps to find out.